Moniz from Love and Hip Hop. We had a great interview, right, Moniz? We did. We made a lot of noise. We did. We? Now, now, what happened? I, I remember asking you about the big guy. The, yeah, that that big basketball player. That, that jolly, that non-jolly giant. Not jolly. No. You know what was crazy? I hadn't spoken to him in forever, and he texted me and told me to kill myself. Kill yourself. Mm-hmm. Not because I asked. I think what happened was a lot of his hookers, current hookers, his harem was upset. Okay. And he tried to prove like, Ugh. but it's like. Now was he? Now I asked you if you had sex with him. You said you talked. Oh, he, so Shaq's dick is not that big. No, I didn't. I didn't say anything. You, okay, right. We didn't say. We're not saying names. No, I didn't say anything. But somebody, somebody that we talked to earlier said to kill yourself. No, I said Shaq texted me and told me to kill Shaq, myself. Shaq. Now, what do you have him listed as? Okay, have him, okay, so first of all, I have him listed in my phone as Booger. Booger. That's what I thought that I saw. That was my nickname for him. Okay. And out of the blue, on October 24th, he texts me because our interview made Media Takeout. Media Takeout. And so I said, I don't know why the hell you keep listening to Media Takeout. So he texts me back. First of all, watch your mouth. You're the one giving him my pussy. That's my pussy. And you keep entertaining bum ass niggas. I said, that's not my dick. Okay, after Wait, that. Wait, who, who? Who? This is Shaq. This well, who, is Shaq and I. Who are, who's, who's he, getting your pussy? Well, he was talking about Scrap De Leon. Oh, because Scrap. Because he asked me if I'd been with anybody from Love and Hip Hop, and I said Love and Hip Hop Atlanta. Right. Scrap. Okay, so he FaceTimed me after this. Shaq did. <laughs> I went off. I cursed him out. I got upset. And then, watch this. So he FaceTimed me after that. Yeah. And... I went off on him. He hung up in my face. I tried to call back. I was blocked. Two oh. days later, I get a phone call from Booger, and then it hangs up. I call back, and I get his call center. The lady puts me on hold, and she's like, he's not available. Would you like for me to have him call you back? I said, sure. All of a sudden, after that, I get this text. This is why you will always be a broke bitch, a famous broke hoe. No one will ever claim you. You will always be community pussy. We laugh at whores. Whoa. Shaq. Go away, please. Mind you, I just showed you the other text and how he spaces everything out. Yeah. Nah, this ain't Shaq. Shaq don't give a fuck about whores. That's evident. Good luck, broke bitch. Go kill yourself. So now he's trying to say it's not him? Yeah, but it's obvious. And then you don't say this isn't Shaq. Shaq doesn't give about whores. That's evident. Like, it's obviously you. And to go kill yourself. Oh, So I said, LOL. Okay, God bless you, booger. Take care. Be well. Damn.